Ginger Brave, wake up. You will despise me, but you are destined to destroy us. Ginger Brave, gather the soul and be brave. And yet, here you are once more, born again and again. This impossible task, only you can. We're sorry. And I, I will destroy you, time and time again, for all eternity. They are waiting. It's time. You're our only hope. What's going on? Why is it so hot? Am I the only one awake? Wait! That smoke is moving! That must mean there's a way out of here! It's too hot! I need to follow the smoke! Looks like I've gotta climb up! What are those things? No! They're eating cookies! There's gotta be something on the floor that I can use as a weapon. This thing looks flimsy, but it'll do for now. Phew! Gotta take care and not get burned. More of them? Alrighty then, bring it on! I can't stay here any longer! I need to go up! Oh! I felt a breeze! A door! And it's open! I'm free! I grow tired of this. Be gone and learn your place, worm. Hey, what's the big idea? Uh, it's too hot. I'm getting dizzy. Hey, over here! We need to leave before we get caught. Hurry! Uh-oh, there's no way I can make it through here. Use something to stop the blades! Hurry! Jump! Jump! Yeah! Oh! That was one heck of a jump. How you feeling? Uh, far from a perfectly baked cookie, that's for sure. You were in the oven for too long, but I've got just the thing. Uh, here, take this. Oh. Huh? Oh. Yeah! <laughs> I packed some meat jellies. It'll help you get back on your feet in no time. Wow! That hit the spot! Thank you! It's too soon to celebrate! We still need to get out of here. Look over there. Are they... cookies? What are they wearing? They're soldiers of the Darkest Lord, Cookie, and they rule the castle with an iron fist. Stay quiet and follow me. The Darkest Lord, Cookie? Who's that? The Cookie who stopped you from escaping. Keep moving, I'll tell you more later. Okay, but... Uh, uh, by the way, what's your name? Ah, allow me to introduce myself. 
I'm Wizard Cookie. <laughs> And you are... Oh, actually, let's save the introductions until we actually escape from here. We can take the ladder down. Darkest Lord Cookie shouldn't be here anymore. Now's our chance! The soldiers seem to be extra vigilant today, as if they were ordered to take every precaution. some sort of glass bottle over there! It seems to have fallen from one of the cupboards above. Yes, this will work to our advantage. Grab one of those candy canes. You'll need a reliable weapon. Wow, it fits perfectly in my hands. As if it was made just for me. Now's our chance to make our escape. Ah! Wizard Cookie! Soldiers! Nothing to worry about! I took care of them! You fought off the soldiers with just a candy cane? Why didn't you run? Because you helped me! And this time, I helped you! That's what friends are for, right? That was... really brave of you. You just might be the ginger brave foretold in the great prophecy. A uh, prophecy? Yes. I came here to rescue you after receiving a prophecy from Prophet Cookie. The details will be explained later. We need to be extra careful from now on. We need to go up there. Jump down? No! As cookies, we might crumble! I need to get you to safety, and in one piece. There has to be something that we can use as a bridge. <laughs> I'm such a genius. I've got an idea. Abra Cookie Lightning Strike! That was awesome! We can get down safely now! More soldiers! Haha! <laughs> <laughs> You've got quite the aptitude for combat! We still have a long way to go. Let's pick up the pace. How much further? Keep your head down! It's a wider page!
Oh, I think we're in the clear. Gotta keep an eye out for them. Let's head down. Hurry! This way! Oh, seriously? How much further? <laughs> Now. Oh, fiddlesticks! The path is blocked. There must be a way to get through here. Whoa! What's that? It's a terrarium. The witch started growing small creatures and life forms in these. There's a Choco drop in there. It seems so sad. Should we set them free? We're just cookies. If we want to free them, we need to go inside ourselves. It's not safe to go barging in without knowing if it's safe. First, let's assess the situation. A proper analysis to see if it's really safe to get in there. Then... Hmm. Yes. No, 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 wait. It might... Maybe? Is there... There could be. Yes, I, th I suppose. I don't know. the outside world looks like too? Now, where'd that Choco drop go? Ah! Ah! Moldy spores! And there's a magic circle behind them! Choco Drop, you want to bust out of here?
just leave someone while they're talking! And you went inside? That's too reckless! Oh, Choco Drop made it out? Were you worried about me? <laughs> no worries, we made it out! There is such a thing as too much courage. <sighs> Let's keep moving, or we're bound to get caught. While you were in there, I kept thinking about ways to get through this debris. And I remembered something I read in a book written by the gnomes. Choco Drop's chocolate coating is said to be stronger than caramelized steel. We can use Choco Drop's ability to bust through that wall! Yippee! We did it! We can keep going! Huh? What's that noise? Minions, surround the area. These nuisances must not escape. So you've managed to escape, Ginger Brave. Whoa! <laughs> Where are we? A safe place. Far away from the darkest Lord Cookie's gaze. Welcome to Gnome Square. You finally made it! And in one piece. Greetings, young one. My name is Prophet Cookie. I am the one who asked Wizard Cookie to aid you in your grand escape. It's great to meet you, Prophet Cookie. Thanks for sending help. It is a great pleasure to finally meet the Cookie from the Prophecy of Old. The Prophecy? Yes. Destiny has much in store for you, friend. You are the one who will lead us to freedom. For we have been trapped here in the Witch's Castle for far too long. The Witch has ordered the Darkest Lord Cookie to prevent any and all forms of escape. I have also foreseen the witch's sinister plot in using cookies for a terrible purpose. We must flee this place lest this horrifying future come to pass. Ah, but where are my manners? I shall spare you of the details for now. First, we must introduce you to the Elder Gnome. The Elder Gnome is this way. You? Why is it glowing? You... Could it be? The statue is reacting just like the prophecy foretold. Darkness shall be vanquished by courage. The statue will light the way. There's no doubt about it. You are the cookie mentioned in the prophecy. We need to meet the Elder Gnome. Quickly! He might know something. fallen asleep while waiting for us. Try waking him up. Uh, what? Oh, it's you, Ginger Brave. 
Yeah, I guess that's my name. Everyone's been calling me that. But how'd you know it was me? Oh, <laughs> I've been waiting for a very, very long time to greet you, my lad. And this is for you. It belonged to a cookie long ago. We've kept it safe for generations. There may be something useful written inside, lad. The writer of that notebook was much like you. A great leader who wished to lead us to freedom. That's a lot of responsibility on my shoulders. I don't think I'm some great leader. In time, you will know. After all, the cookie statue shines in your presence. How did you... Huh? Weren't you sleeping until a few moments ago? Oh, I am certain that you are the one mentioned in the prophecy. But there's more to the prophecy. The statue will glow, and a new day will shine. With it, a chance to escape you will find. The prophecy is unclear, but it is said that you have the power to change the fate for all cookie kind. Did he just fall asleep? Right when things were getting interesting. <sighs> you should take a look around it. This place should have everything you need for the next journey. Once you're all set, go find Prophet Cookie. He probably has something more to say. Don't know where to visit first? Why not head over to the shop? They've got all sorts of goods. You're bound to find something useful there. Shopkeeper know, and these are my wares. Looking for something in particular? Hello, I'm Ginger Brave. This is my first time here, and I don't know what I should buy. Ah, looking for recommendations. How about some ammo? After all, what use is a slingshot without ammo? Eh? Meat jellies are a fine choice, too. They're super healthy. Oh, but I don't have anything to trade with. Not a problem. First time visitors get a small gift of gold to thank you for your future patronage. <laughs> Here, take it. Oh, thanks. Now go ahead, do something. You should also pay a visit to the Gnome Works. They've got all sorts of weapons on sale. The Gnome Works, huh? Smith in this town. 
I craft and repair weapons. <laughs> it's your first visit here, is it? <laughs> I can tell. Here, take this. A welcome gift. Oh, wow. Thanks. Now, what do you need? Anything catch your eye? Come back if you need a new weapon or repairs. <laughs> Shot nearby. Maybe you can use that to knock them down? My attempts at using the slingshot were fruitless. Okay, leave it to me. This must be the slingshot the gnome mentioned. I should use this to knock down those meat jellies. Aim for one of the meat jellies, but not this one. This one, I will pick my hand! A perfect shot! Amazing! You're a natural with the slingshot! You can take that one. It's a thank you gift. Freshly picked meat jellies are the best! Ooh. And you can keep that slingshot, too. Thanks so much. I'll take extra good care of it. The gnomes are so kind. I love them. <laughs> Whoops, almost forgot. Prophet Cookie wanted a word. Exploring the square, I see. Here, take this, my friend. contains a piece of my crystal ball. It will guide you on your path. I am certain that you will make good use of it. I also have a favor to ask of you. Go to the study and find Alchemist Cookie. Alchemist Cookie? Who's that? Let me explain. I have been searching for a way to escape this castle for years. I have surmised that there is only one way out. Through the front gates. Observe the ancient murals. Does it not look like the cookies are about to pass through the gates? But we are only small cookies. The gates are too large and heavy to move on our own. But... I've heard that Alchemist Cookie is researching something about a gigantic hulking cookie. With that cookie's strength, we might just be able to open the gates and escape. It is imperative that you meet Alchemist Cookie. You must enlist her aid, Ginger Brave. Okay, sounds like a plan. Leave it to me. Ha ha! Such remarkable enthusiasm. Alchemist Cookie will most likely be in the laboratory. You can get there by taking the shrew cab. Gather courage. 
become stronger. Gain allies, friends. Become one in the spirit of courage. be around here somewhere. Should I climb up and get a better look at the area? Huh. What was that noise? Is that Alchemist Cookie? Ginger Brave! Hmm. I've never seen you around, but you seem oddly familiar. Nope! Shush! For now, step back! I'm in the middle of an extremely delicate experiment. Alchemy requires perfect timing and measurements. One mistake could mean disaster! Are you Alchemist Cookie? Oh, how do you... I guess my reputation precedes me. Alchemist Cookie, the best alchemist in all history. It's great to meet you. I'm here because I heard you might need help with something. Huh? Me? Help? Who told you that? Prophet Cookie. He mentioned something about a giant cookie who can open the gates. Prophet Cookie said that? About me? And the gates? Wait, if I... No. You could be... Yes, if they'd stop pestering. Yes, I shall aid you. Up high, my new friend. <laughs> Alrighty. <laughs> Let's begin. Come over here. You have to see this. It's truly a spectacle to behold. Use the looking glass. Move it around using both hands. See that giant cookie? We're pretty far out, so the cookie may not seem that big. Whoa! Is that really a cookie? Yep, that's Franken Cookie. Fast asleep. For now. If you want to get the gates open, we're going to need Franken Cookie's help. To wake him up, we're gonna need a revival potion. A revival potion? Yep. I've been researching methods to concoct the most potent of revival potions. The potion is almost complete. Just need to make finishing touches. I should recheck the formula. No room for mistakes. We need to find a book. It's got the answers I need. It's in the study. Hurry, this way. By the way, why do you want to open the gate? To escape. You don't want to be stuck here, do you? For now, I'm okay with it. After all, my goal is to wake up Frank and Cookie. I guess heading to the outside world will be an option. There'll be more things to research out there. That's weird. There used to be a ladder here. Did the ladder just grow legs and run away?
coming here. I pretty much had the lab to myself the entire time. But the darkest Lord Cookie's army has been acting oddly. They're everywhere. But why? Do they think Frank and Cookie is a threat? Phew. Politics mumbo jumbo, maybe? I'll stick with alchemy, thank you. Now, let's find that book. Bear, bear, bear. Jelly bear, bear, bear. Jelly Berry Bear! Come on, Gingerbread! Keep up! The book is waiting for us! onto that bookshelf.
Are you alright? That looks like it hurt. Oh, oh, yeah, I, I, I'm fine. Let's open the book. Not yet. Well, actually, we can't. The book is locked, and we don't have a key. The book is locked? Yeah, the witch must have thought this book to be extra special. The witch wouldn't let me copy anything from this book, especially stuff relating to Frank and Cookie. Huh. I remember seeing the witch hiding the key above the fireplace, in a safe. The fireplace is in the lounge. It's connected to the study. Let's get moving. Who keeps moving the ladder? Is it those pesky soldiers? I'll meet you in front of the stairs. See you there. These stairs will take us to the study.
What are you waiting for? Let's snap it in! It's just a painting.
Hey, another terrarium! I better get this fella out.
car. You still have the key, right? Yep, it's in my bag. Excellent. Now then, time to open the book. Give me the key. This is it. How does such a simple thing act as a key? I've always wanted to know. Maybe there's magic inside this jewel. Or, this is no time for distractions. I need to open that book. chamber. Hmm. There's a lot of collapsed paths here and there. I think we'll be fine, though.
about this. to go ahead to the 
the auditorium and get ready to revive Franken Cookie. Don't forget anything. Understand? Trust me, I've memorized everything. Alrighty, then I'll see you soon. I need to find the reagents first. Drake's on. Hmm. Looks like I have to just grab a hold of this and pull!
Rejuvenation Elixir? Check! Time to get the next reagents on the list! Present and accounted for. Not bad, not bad. You work fast, don't you? Great work. Now hand him over. Crimson Mandrake. Rejuvenation elixir. And a lizard's tail. Perfect. We're all set. It's finally time to concoct the Revival Potion! Watch and learn, Ginger Brave! You're about to witness alchemy history! Alchemist Cookie, we've got soldiers! Incoming! Alchemy is cool, and 
as an alchemist, that means I am cool. Okay then, enough chatter. Let's get going. To where? To Franken Cookie, of course. It's finally time to revive Franken Cookie. to experiment with moonlight here. They wanted to create a cookie harnessing the power of the moon, but they failed. The cookie was out of their control and they scrapped the experiment. The cookie in question is the same one you saw in the laboratory. Put one and one together yet? Yep, I'm talking about Franken Cookie. I was baked by the witches and tasked with finding a way to control Franken Cookie. See that thing on the ceiling? That's a moonlight focus. Franken Cookie's right below it. Where the witches failed, I, Alchemist Cookie, shall succeed. This revival potion will wake up Franken Cookie in perfect condition, too. That's amazing. Let's hurry up, then we'll be out of here. We have two things to do first. Step one, we need to realign the moonlight reflectors and start collecting energy into the focus. Those statues are holding on to reflective mirrors. We need to realign them. Step two, we need to give the potion to Franken Cookie. Take the elevator to get up there. Once both steps are done, we aim the moonlight focus onto Franken Cookie. Simple, eh? Let's realign those reflectors first. So this is a moonlight reflector. I'm supposed to realign by swiveling it around? Correct. See the large and small handles there? Use them to get the reflectors in place.
Let's get this thing into place! Hang on! Uh, 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 
scariest moment of my entire life! Poisoned by futile words and ambitions. Your life to protect the dreams of others is not courage. It is merely reckless bravado. I may not know what bravado means, but I know one thing. I know that no one wants to be trapped here like ants. And for that, I'll keep fighting. Your bravery remains intact, but not for long. Zombie cookie? One spell. <laughs> it was a piece of cake. The statue was already breaking. I just finished the job, that's all. Anyone could have done it. Your magic could help defeat the Darkest Lord Cookie. Mm -hmm. Been given enchanted armor and a wand from the witch herself. It's not simple. Alas, my magic won't be enough. I need time to cast a mortal. Powerful spell. See, magic is too volatile. Alchemy is precise and calculated. It's more reliable than magic. <laughs> ah, you're practically paralyzed when you run out of reagents. Magic is about the strength within. Huh? But you're useless without that wand of yours. Admit it. Alchemy is the superior craft. <sighs> Say that again to my face. Hey, hey, everyone calm down. Even 
Zombie Cookie knows you all are taking this too far. Huh? And who's this? I've never seen them before. Everyone, meet Zombie Cookie. Zombie Cookie was inside Frank and Cookie's heart. A cookie was inside another cookie? As an ingredient? Well, actually, Frank and Cookie was never a living cookie to begin with. What we knew as Frank and Cookie was more like giant armor for Zombie Cookie. So, how could... No cookie would ever do such a thing to another cookie. Hey, snap out of it! Zombie Cookie was inside Frankie Cookie. End of story. All you magic wielders are so illogical. Huh. Wizard Cookie and Alchemist Cookie don't seem like the best of friends. My crystal ball told me that something lively was happening in Gnome Square. Job well done. Zombie Cookie. It has been a long, long time. Ah, you may not remember me. I saw you taken by the witch when you were done baking. I thought you had gone missing. But no, you were within Franken Cookie this entire time. We must make haste and leave this place. Who knows what insidious plans the witch has for us. Hey, so, um, where is the witch, exactly? Gone, for now. Something about gathering some rare ingredients from far, far away. Then that must mean we still have some time left, right? We cannot assume such a thing. After all, the Darkest Lord Cookie still serves the witch with fervor. And with such power... <laughs> Zombie Cookie's right! It's too soon to give up now! Together, I know we'll find a way to get out of here! Huh? You understood that gibberish? Ginger Brave is correct. We must bide our time and enhance our strength. What about the blacksmith? I often commissioned that cookie to craft some equipment. Quality stuff, too! After all, you can't fend off the Darkest Lord Cookie and the soldiers with just a candy cane. Ah, avocado cookie? Yes, a brilliant idea! With Avocado Cookie's help, we may be able to get our hands on a new, stronger weapon. But for now, you must rest. You've gone through much today.
are, my friend. Come, come, take a look at this. Tell me, does this look familiar to you in any way? This painting is identical to the mural found in Gnome Square. I believe this mural contains an answer for us to seek. The key to our escape. But the mural is dilapidated. It is proving difficult to decipher. If we could somehow recreate the image in its entirety, we will be one step closer to freedom. Ah, uh, alas, this depiction has been torn into unrecognizable pieces. By my crystal ball, the painting has been completed. We must compare it to the mural. Yes, yes, yes. They are indeed identical. We may be able to decipher the mural now. What's going on here? Wait. That's the mural's original form. It has an aura of extreme import. I'll join in on the deciphering effort. I'm sure my knowledge of the arcane will help us. <laughs> My knowledge of ancient alchemy is more likely to prove useful in times like this. Just you wait. I'll be the one to decipher that mural in no time. It's good to see academics come together for a common cause. Ginger Brave, we shall busy ourselves with the mural. In the meantime, you must meet Avocado Cookie and ask for a formidable weapon. Avocado Cookie is in the metalworks. I believe Muscle Cookie is there as well. The two are creating weapons and armor for the Darkest Lord Cookie's forces. But recently, the soldiers have been keeping a keen eye on Avocado Cookie. I am not certain as to why the Darkest Lord Cookie is keeping tabs on Avocado Cookie. Convince them to help our cause and obtain a powerful weapon. Is Avocado Cookie willingly helping the Darkest Lord Cookie? But... but why? In the past, the Evil One was not the foul and sinister Cookie we know today. Something must be up there. All right, guess I'll need to meet her and ask. The shrew cab stop in the metalworks has been fixed. Go there with haste. You still don't realize are a threat to us, to all cookies. Reconsider. I see. Then eradication is the only choice. Keeping an eye on Avocado Cookie.
A visitor? Hi, I'm Gingerbread. I'm here because I heard that you were a blacksmith. Ha <laughs> ha, you came to the right place. You need something? I can make everything. Oh, but introductions first. My name's Avocado Cookie. And this lump here is... I'm Muscle Cookie! I was wondering if you could make me a weapon? I needed to defeat the Darkest Lord Cookie. The Darkest Lord Cookie is strong! You're no match for such a strong cookie! Mmm. Your eyes, they're burning with courage. But let's put that courage to the test first. Then we'll talk. Uh, a test? Yes! The test of resolve! A bunch of materials laid out on that anvil. Let's use them for the test. This won't be a cakewalk. Swing the hammer down as fast as you can and mold him into shape. Here, take this hammer and start swinging. Okay, I just have to swing the hammer down quickly and make a shape. the hammering. You're more than capable of wielding a weapon made by me. All done? Return the hammer and let's take a look. Give me five. What do you call a cookie waiting for a high five? Nope. I got nothing. I'll need more materials to make something for you. Head into the mines. Get me some iron ore and some frost stones. You'll need a pickaxe, a helmet, and some gloves to go mining! Let's go to the armory together! This elevator will take us to the armory! all this stuff! Avocado Cookie made all this equipment! Everything you need for mining can be found here! But the soldiers are taking the equipment without even asking! <clears throat> Find the mining equipment you need and meet me at my climbing tower, deep inside the armory! He's so fast! Okay, mining equipment. I should start looking. Oh, it's a map of the armory. I'm guessing the stuff I need is near these marked stars. Looks like the soldiers are guarding the key I need. Hooray! 
I found the key! I'm looking for has got to be in these crates somewhere. Cookie, I'm ready to start mining. 
Not so fast, Skinny! You need to pass the test of might first! The Darkest Lord Cookie is a mighty warrior! Why are you determined to fight such a fair leader? A fair leader? That's not the Darkest Lord Cookie that I know. <laughs> then let's let our muscles decide that! Feed me to the top of this tower! Then, I'll think about helping you! How is he so fast? I should probably get moving! trying to fight the Darkest Lord Cookie, but recently, Avocado Cookie's been less than happy with the situation. Ugh. As long as I can continue training my muscles, I am happy with anything. But these soldiers, they dare to get in the way of my workouts? Everything you need? Hmm? Be careful out there. Oh, and mind your business. <laughs> Come, this will take us to the lava mine. Awesome! The war we need is deeper inside! There's a fork in the road. Which way do we go? You take the left path! The frost stones will be that way! I'll go right and find us some iron! Let's hurry! Today is leg day! And you should never forget leg day! See you soon! I think this will take me deeper inside.
cart to Wow, this heat, it's unbearable.
So this is a frost stone. The pickaxe I brought should be the perfect tool to collect it. Cookie, we need your help! Muscle Cookie's trapped behind some rocks down in the mine! <gasps> what? Is he okay? He's fine for now, just stuck! He said you have something that can move the rocks. A bomb! <laughs> I have just the thing! Here you go! Thanks! Oh, you are covered in dust! At this rate, I might have to call you Ginger Dust! I'm okay. Just a bit of dust from fighting soldiers in the mine. Soldiers? Huh. Anyway, go help Muscle Cookie first. We'll talk later about the soldiers. I'll be back soon. Oh, before I forget, the Frost Stone. No need to lug that heavy rock around. Leave it here. Not bad, Ginger Brave. I'll start making preparations. 
Monster? Come back here, you! I won't forgive you! Oh, hey, wait up! Childish tactics are no 
no match for me. Just you wait. I will soon unleash my full power. No time to waste. We need to get out of here. Hard to escape from the lava toad. That monster knew my name. Uh huh. Let's talk. Come this way. The lava toad, huh? Hmm. The darkest Lord Cookie must really want something from you. You mean the lava toad and the darkest Lord Cookie are working together? More like the lava toad is working for the darkest Lord Cookie. I knew the toad lived in the mine, but it was always sleeping. I wonder when it woke up. That lava toad. How could it live in a place that's hotter than the oven? Anyway, did you find what we needed? Iron ore. Here. Perfect! It's time to craft a weapon! Ginger Brave, stand beside me! You'll be my assistant! Got it! What should I do? Use the bellows to keep the forge at a perfect temperature! Anything else? Just ask!
have you been, my mustachioed chum? I am. Well, I've managed. I have vowed to stand tall and no longer cower in fear. That's good to hear. Oh, speaking of things good to hear, look into my future and tell me something good, huh? I already have. Your future lies with us. Come with me, and I will show you where you can stay. Oh, Gingerbrave, we found another mural painting. But first, you must rest. You've had quite a long day. Brave. Come, take a look. We found something, but this one's also torn to shreds. Deciphering the mural can't continue unless this painting is restored. That's just what we're looking for. You have our thanks, Gingerbrave. So far, we figured out that we need something extraordinary to escape from this place. But we still don't exactly know what this extraordinary item is, or where it's located. With the pieces you've brought, we may be able to surmise some more details. Sounds good. In the meantime, I'm going to pay a visit to the dragon. Uh, 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 pardon? Did, did you say... the dragon? The ancient dragon might be able to help us figure out a way to defeat the Darkest Lord Cookie. Ooh, dragons possess incredible wisdom and knowledge. Okay then, we'll stay here and continue deciphering the mural. I'm certain that the answer to escaping the castle is here. It'll be immensely useful. Oh, by the way, the way to the garden is blocked. The gnomes will get to making a path, but until then, you should hone your skills and stock up. Okay, thanks for the heads up. My lord, we've received a report. The Lava Toad has failed to capture the one called Ginger Brave. It matters not. All we need is to find the Brave Souls. Our troops are searching every possible location for it, my liege. Double your efforts. All is lost if that brat Ginger Brave obtains the ancient weapon for himself. As you command. Shall not succeed. 